This is a galvanized steel chicken waterer. At least it's the bottom part of one. We have to use these instead of plastic because uh, in the winter time, these need to sit on a heated base. The problem is they don't put enough galvanizing on them and they soon rust and you get holes like you see here. I'm gonna show you how to patch this uh, sort of a problem. You can see I've done it before. It's just a matter of soldering and uh, you can extend the life probably two or three times beyond what you'd normally get uh, with a little bit of soldering. So the job begins as with all soldering with uh, cleaning the surface. So this is the hole here. I'm gonna get back to bare metal so that it's shiny. I also want to make sure this hole is is as big as it should be. I mean, if there's a, a weak area right around it, I want to punch through that so that I can fill the whole thing with solder. It's a pretty big hole, and I have to be careful with this. But um, this is what you want it to look like when we get to this stage. Next step is some flux. This is uh, kind of a paste, it's acidic, and it helps to clean the surface of the metal even more. In order for solder to work, for it to actually stick to the metal and bond to the pores of the metal, it needs to actually be very clean. Um, I'm gonna be using some of this lead-free solder. Uh, you can get it anywhere. Lead-free used to be a specialty years ago, but uh, lead-free is commonly available now. And uh, I'll spark up the torque. The thing about soldering like this is that you don't want to use very much heat. It is possible to overheat the metal. And that will you know, burn the flux and turn it all black. And So now I'm just gently heating. That flux is spreading out. Okay, now that solder's starting to melt there. It's not quite hot enough, but if I make it too hot, it's just gonna flow right through that hole, so I have to kind of span the gap here. Oh, that's, there it is. Bonding pretty nicely. And that's it. Doesn't take too long, just wait for it to cool a bit here and uh, you can see that we've got another repair to add to the to the others that are here we'll get another six months or so unless there's a really weak spot somewhere in which case I'll have to do it again before then <laughs>